Hello guys, welcome. Today we'll be handling a question on a section through strip foundation when given the following data. We into a scale of 1 is to 10. So it means that we are going to divide the data that we have been given with a scale of 1 of 10. And therefore, any data that we are given, we will be dividing the data into 10 uh, millimeters. So for instance, in the depth of the foundation is 1000. So you just need to divide this one with 10 and then you get 100 which is 100 millimeters equal to 10 centimeters foundation wall is 200 strip footing is 600 by 200 article field is 300 blighting is 500 and then dpm a thousand gauge brc mesh is 142 and then we have concrete floor 150 millimeter thick so we start with the power foundation depth which is 1000 and therefore, when you divide 1000 with 10, you get 100. Then it is 10, which is equivalent to, to 10 centimeters. So I just measure 10. So I just start from here. This I, I measure 10 millimeters. And therefore, I just start. So from here, I measure 10. And I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. That is the top of my foundation so this is the bottom and this is the top of my foundation uh, warring so i just need to measure the thickness of the wall and i'll just uh, produce a particle line for the wall and then i'll measure the thickness of the wall which is given as 220 200 millimeters so 200 millimeters divided by 10 it is 20 20 equals 2 centimeters. So using my ruler, I just measure 20 millimeters. It is up to this point. And then I go at the bottom. 20 millimeters. 20 millimeters is up to here. And uh, when I'm still measuring 20, I can be able to measure the base, which is 600. So I just add 200. And also add 200 on the other side for the base so i can just draw a straight line from here that is for the total base the footing the depth of the strip footing is 600 so i just measure 600 this is 90 and 200 up to this point and also the depth of the foundation is the top footing is 20 so i just measure 20 again and also i measure 20 on the other side So with that, I have my foundation footing. My strip footing. So this is the strip footing. And uh, I can now do the strap. I just extend this one. The drip of the strap is given and it is 150 it is here so just measure 150 that is one centimeter and a half because it is 1.5 centimeters so i just measure 1.5 using my ruler so 1.5 is this is one 1.5 is almost up to that point so and I can also increase my height because of the wall. Then I can be able to draw the DPC. So with that, I have my base. That is the foundation strap 
this one I can feed it this point sorry so with that I'm able to grow my foundation worry and my strip footing. Uh, from the foundation slab, below the slab immediately we have DPM and before the DPM we have given DPM as a thousand gauge which is very small because this is just a gauge so we just a polythene paper that one we can assume the depth because you cannot measure a thousand gauge so that one we just assume the depth and then for the Braiding it is 50 millimeters, so it is 50 divided by 10 5 millimeters for the braiding. It is here, and then we have Habico is 300 millimeters, so we measure that divided by 10, so it is 30 millimeters equal to 3 centimeters. So I just measure 3 1, 2, 3. So Habico up to this point. And uh, with that, I can be able to draw all the materials required. So I just need the horizontal lines for this. This is the uh, DPM. Immediately after DPM, I have braiding. Remember the thickness of the DPM we have assumed because you cannot measure a thousand gauge, it is very small support in paper size so you cannot measure so because it is continuing you just put a continuity line show that the materials are continuing that way so from there i can catch the drawing and therefore this is concrete the symbol for concrete and then for foundation work we can use bricks or masonry. For my case, I will use masonry. So for masonry, this is how we match. So that is the strip footing and therefore we have it already. So what I need now is Hadiko. So for Hadiko, so the same for Hadiko, six are grinds. That is Hadiko. And then we have Riding. This is Maram. And then I have DPM. This is the symbol for DPM. And concrete floor slab. Remember, we have to draw the RC mesh. 
and uh, for BRC, we just put a dashed line inside the concrete floor. So BRC mesh, just a dashed line so that there is a little uh, BRC mesh A142 in our slab. And also, we can provide DPC just immediately after the slab. The purpose of the DPC is to prevent ingress of water or water to capillarize through the wall from the ground floor. So you can also provide ground floor on this side. This ground floor. So with this, we can put the emissions. This is 600. This is 600. And uh, for the height, we have 200 for the strip footing and then 1000 for the foundation wall so for this one here yeah, the depth the foundation strip footing is 200 by 600 this is 200 and it is here 200 and then the depth is 1000 The depth from the ground floor is 1000. So from there, we just name the parts of the strip coating and therefore I'm starting with foundation wiring. I'll start with foundation wiring. So Then I go to strip footing, and then from there I go to the other foundation elements. So with this, you can just name them. So just drop the arms. And then I have concrete slab here. So with this just draw the arm. And I can just drag the titles. So I can start with foundation warning. And uh, foundation warning, 
can just drag it here two hundred millimeter thick foundation wall. Then for strip footing, I just drag it here. So I have them. Then hardico two hundred, three hundred it is here. And then I have riding fifty millimeters it is here. And then I have DP uh, DP uh, DPM. Now sub gauge and then I have concrete floor this one is at the bottom and then I have BRC mesh A142 and uh, then I have DPC I have DPC so I have DPC here and also I can join this one to put a finish on 100 millimeter 150 millimeter cross slab so with this we have solved our fusion where we have our strip footing fully detailed and fully named to a scale of 1 is to 10. Thank you and kindly subscribe to my channel. Welcome.